So what is going on guys? This is Ryan here and welcome back to We Happy Few. This is it guys. This is where we commence now in the final act of this game and that means one thing. It's nearly over. The whole story of We Happy Few guys is nearly over. We've done act one and act two aka Sally and Arthur's. And now we're here. However guys, they say they save the best until last and I believe with Ollie's story, that's exactly what's gonna happen, okay? There is no point in being down in the dumps about this one. I've got a feeling this last chapter is gonna be the most quirky and also the most fun and also... We're gonna meet a fellow Scotsman, you know what I say? That was a weak accent. Anyway though guys, the last thing we're gonna do is hop straight into Act 3 and just have some fun with this one. But uh, I mean, as even Ollie may say, take your joy, alright? It's happening, I guys. I if the lad he got away all right. Oh, heck yeah, dude. <laughs> Wasn't that the caper? I thought he'd never cut the power. <laughs> Let's go, man. Well, I'm so ready. I hope she likes it. <sighs> Me too. Me too. You know the painting, guys? That wasn't very nice, what you did to Arthur. That's got to be a delusion. What did you do while I was out? Stuff. Wait, what? Chanterelle? I guess not. You're a master of conversation. This is fascinating. Look what, what I got you in the warehouse. Oh. A toy? She's so pretty. To be honest, she looks like she's been crapped on, okay? Give the thing a bath. Maybe it'll look nicer. There's our wife, by the way, guys. She's that shiny picture right there. Yeah, we sleep with that thing. Don't question it, all right? Heck's that? So it was in our imagination, okay? Wait, is this where Arthur comes through? That's a fair bit of Christmas there, isn't it? Oh! Did you know the pals she wasn't the lock? They're all quite mad, you know, the home army lads. Did you know this is the crazy. Power switch was a lock? I think they want the Germans to come back. <laughs> it's a shame of it, you see. You bloody <laughs> knew! This is For so cool, man. For heaven's sake, Artie, times are hard, but you and I are neighbours from way back. Fair, fair, fair. So this is where it begins, huh? The last the encounter. The tanks are hollow, Ollie. Ooh. Papier mache. The tanks, they're made of papier mache. <laughs> like Why is he so like that? What's he doing, and casting before, spells? <laughs> if they didn't really have tanks. Did, did you know they were fake? Of course mm. not. I would have had to lie my way off that train. I would have told the lads. But, would have risen up. But, Ollie, this is dramatic, though. You were the general secretary. I did. You must have known. Don't forget a thing like that. I lied my way mm. off that If we'd have known, we'd have risen up. We'd have had to. So he was talking to the girl. Would have saved you and everyone else's kids. Didn't you hear me? I have to go find him. Oh. Talking about Percy. Bridge is crawling with policemen. There's that thingamajig you told me about. But I was going to use that. <laughs> you were going to leave what? me. Look at this dude, like, lurking at straight in our face right there. You're my what? daughter. They'll never believe you're a bridge inspector. You're but right. They did. You're always right. <laughs> Just shove him out of the way right there. Oh, uh, this is going to be fun. Take to the maiden home bridge and tell the bobbies you're there to fix the bridge works. And it worked. And from maiden home... I can get to Apple Hall. Oh, say hello to Percy for me. Yeah, if we find well, him, then. that is. See you on the other side. Maybe. Maybe. We'll see about that one, huh? What a dramatic intro. No? Is Ollie's story about to be the most interesting? I, I don't see how you could have not known. Secrets are secrets. Known about the tanks, Meg. I'd never have forgotten such a thing. I'll see the general. He'll tell you. He'll tell us I never knew. Okay. Margaret. Is that our daughter then? He has to. Okay. Margaret. She ain't responded. Whoa! Ah, my freak. Shit. <laughs> Someone's broken in. Ollie hits harder than most people, but he's there. slower too. Wait, what about us? Let I me take a look. I setting up some kind uh, of bomb. Okay, I see oh, nothing other than a few dudes down there. Go eat a banger, you <laughs> Dude, this is about to be so much fun, all right? Blue Molotovs at the dozen. Okay, watch this over here. So rotate the wheel, emergencies only. Huh. You know what? I better save this Serious? for when I need it. Bro, there's people breaking into your apartment. <clears throat> I've got a timer as well. i got 50 seconds. I gotta knock these dudes out straight up. Okay, look, I'm Ollie. I'm a heavy brute, and these guys, they don't know what's coming. I got the cricket bat with, like, steel around it. And they're just like, okay, they got hammers. Fair enough. Let me test this out then. Ooh. Down in two swings. All right, my dude. You're next. Wait, where's he gone? I'll take your swing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm home, my dude. You get the freak. I'm my home, you dingus. 
All right, there's the second one down. I got 10 seconds, all right? Get out of your system. There you go. Okay, disarm this thing. It's a freaking bomb. We'll get what's coming to us oh in the end. All the time. Oh, my God. What the hell are they getting explosives? Woo. Sweep for more. Histoplasma? Okay. Give me that stuff. Guys, we were 0.04 milliseconds away from blowing the freak up right there. Let's go ahead and loot these freaking dinguses though, right? So we're gonna be a very, very hated individual then, I'd imagine, around here. So almost everyone wants a piece. Let's just give them exactly what they want, huh? They're gonna set more bumps off? They're gonna get more smacks around the face? I wonder if that's when Sally came in then, you know? I think they're setting think up some kind of bomb. I think they've already done it right now, you know? Uh-oh. Oh, they are. What the freak? They literally want us dead. This is insane. I think we might need to get out of here. I think you're right, little girl. Fortunately for you, you're a ghost. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's freaking go. Alright, there's the- Ooh, not down yet. Come on, I got a minute. Hurry up. Right, that's it. You're taking a hit to the face, I'll teach you for resting. Okay, and you can go down too. Come on! Alright, there you go. Now he's down as well. So the bomb. Is it this way here? Alright. Have I gotta jump down because I'm gonna break my ankles up right now? Uh, okay, gotta pull the lever. Let's go. We're on this thing. Hurry up. Jericho is our location. Alright, let's go. Let's do this. Up, 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 up. Here we go. Up and over here. Okay, just sound the bomb. Okay, ignore him! Come on! Let's go. What? Oh, are these dudes swinging? Are you kidding? Dude, I gotta keep swinging right now. They gotta go down. Come on, let's go. There you go. There's two. I don't know if I got time. I had no freaking idea what is going on. It's, um, it's not looking good. I'm just saying. We're dead. Already. You know what, let's take a read of this entry. The Victory Memorial Camp Gazette, I think that says. Sergeant Oliver Starkey, a three-time army boxing champion, has been recommended for a combat decoration. Ollie always did like to mix it up, says a former colleague who declined to be named for fear that Starkey might not actually have gone on holiday. Starkey's penchant for pugilism had twice previously resulted in his being stripped of his sergeant rank. However, those same talents always helped him restore his rank afterwards. His decoration ceremony will take place when he returns from his holiday. Let this be a lesson to Here you. Here we go. That was much better for time though, guys, but the uh, little escalator thing was already at the bottom, so I had to jump from the top down. What? Yeah. No bother, no bother. Let's just go on through. So Tea Leaves got some of that Victory V meat. Give me that good stuff. You know what though, guys? This place is in complete ruins. I got a bad feeling about this place. Don't this is no longer going to be my home. Don't forget You don't want to leave them behind. Okay, Better fair get point. everything I can scavenge out of there. Careful. Sure. Those people might still be here. It's so, all right. I got this good stuff. So we're going to go up here, I think. Maybe up and over. Yeah, I think so. Okay, what was that? A metal tube? If we could take the hammer, that would be nice. Guess not, though. Let's go ahead, hop down. We got some business to do still. There's people here. Where we the got hell it. Do I get out of here? The doors are blocked. Get you out. Never heard we that can't one. can't stay here. The roof's going to fall on our heads any minute. Interesting. How about we go back up and jump off the roof? <laughs> no. Are you crazy? No. Well, we'll have that parachute, so it's better than it sounds. Are you mad? You're going to take a parachute up to the roof and jump off? If you've got a better idea, don't be shy. I kind of want this to happen right now. Please tell me that's what we're gonna do. I think it really is. This way here then, guys, is our only way out. Bit of parkour. Okay, Ollie, you're a big man, but you got a lot of strength, so pull your weight up. There you go. Now, we're not being timed here, so I'm spending a bit of time collecting any of the first aid stuff that I can. This dude is a big guy, so he's probably got a lot of health and needs more than the other two, I guess. But let's go ahead and find out. Okay, four dormant people. Gonna have to meet the cricket, but I'm afraid, guys, I'm sorry. You're in the one way I gotta be. Or are they? Of <laughs> I'm gonna love this so much, dude. Um, okay, not so much this, though. What the freak is going on? Who's laughing like that? Bro, this is so freaking bizarre. Okay, we got Bobby's right there. Okay, my vision, look at this, it's so blurry. Do I gotta take them all out? Just... They've seen me. It's all over, here we go. Freak. Oh, damn, that was a good time shove. Now, this guy, though, is so much better at combat in terms of the... I say that as he gets hit so many times. All right, that with those guys. Well, uh, Look, we got to do this. This is what we train for. Sure thing. Go ahead and use this thing up. He's nice and powerful, though, Ollie is. It makes the combat a lot more enjoyable. i got to time those dodges, though. Perhaps, uh, I don't know, when we get some skill points, that's exactly what we can upgrade. All right, come on, let's keep going, though, man. we got to get the heck out of here as soon as possible and not stumble just like that go forth wow. and sin no more nasty way to go right there i'm afraid wasn't me though don't care yeah, but now we go i see this uh the girl's right there that's the parachute now just need to get there. up on that roof you're not seriously I going can't to believe jump off this is the gonna roof happen. come on live a little wow uh, bad choice of words sorry she's dead by the way all right let's get back to our base though all right 
Gotta get up and out. Is Margaret coming with? Because like, I don't want to part with her, to be honest. What a dramatic way to begin Ollie's story, though, right? Some more people. What the freak are you boys doing up here? Get off the roof right now! Teach your dingus out of my face Sorry, permanently. I, that. I ain't. They deserved it. Oh, my God. Another explosion. Are you saying their fuse, right? Again. Well, what if Private Wuss's name lied to us? Calm down. He's not right. stupid. We've got to so no up. If we don't come back, he'll starve to death. They've captured okay. one of the home army lads. I could really? signal somebody for the window. Pop back to Canary House if you're worried about it. Wow. Who's there? All right, we're gonna have to take him out. Even the female. Look, if they wanna fight, I got a bat, and we're gonna have to fight. Look how many there is. Are you kidding me? All right, they are not easing up on the combat here, though. What the freak? I think there's no guards on Molly. So uh, check this out. Just like freaking that, okay? <laughs> All right, we're nearly dead again, though. So. Uh, I think you do. You've seen that little girl just about everywhere. Just saying, Ollie, you might want to rethink that one just a tad. Another first aid. Can you stop exploding? Can you wait for me to heal up? Thank you. My dudes, we've got to get back up this place, you know? This does not seem good in the slightest. Uh, then again, we're about to parachute from the top, so I don't know what we're thinking, but we are Ollie. I'm going to have to get used to saying that crap because I this dude just does it. Where are you? I have no idea. Should we do this then? Don't worry. Nope. I won't forget your dives. Let's go. Get down here, Ollie's backpack, we got a buck, the clubber, uh, a chest, we'll take everything. Margaret's doll, and of course a picture of Margaret. I think they're setting up Don't another bomb. That. Where oh. the hell are they getting explosives? Oh wait, they're missing something. Okay, good, I think. So is it time? Oh, I think they found it. It's time, right now, okay. Now we gotta go ahead and rotate this wheel. No more waiting around for this stuff. I don't know what it's gonna do. The fusing. Right there, okay, look, it's time to go. Come on, Ollie, start climbing, what are you doing? Here we go. All we gotta do then, guys, is jump. If you're well, it's better than well, breaking my I've face up, you know? wanted to try it. Parachuting, I mean. This is I've gonna be insane, guys. My legs once. Don't All right. recommend it. Gonna need that scotch afterwards, okay? But I got some time to do some looting, okay? An axe in there, and I think that might be just about it, so, uh, bombs away? <laughs> No, okay. Let's go, man. Let's this do doesn't this. work. I won't feel stupid for long. <laughs> I mean, he's a man of logic. She can just do that. Wait for me! <laughs> Wait, Margaret? That's so... That's the girl in like... Okay, I'm stopping right there. Holy crap! This is freaking insane! Oh, for Christ's sake! You're good, man. You're good. Ah, for sake. Okay, partially good. But we made it, right? Just in time as well. But some interesting Hold stuff us. popping up already. Like rubble. I'm never going back there. Doesn't matter. He'll tell me I didn't know about the tanks. Sure. He's got it. But we can't get into the military camp. Gosh, look, I wonder if that soldier like can help. Crapped up. The one the wastrels kidnapped. Good point. So go to the Canary House, okay. Tutorial of being Ollie. People don't like you, and not just because you occasionally insult them, you just don't fit in, and we know how well is treat people who don't fit in. You are muscular, a trained soldier, but if you want to avoid having to murder people, stay out of sight when you're trespassing. You are mechanically brilliant, but you can't use a chem lab to save your life. Ollie, everyone. All right, we know his quirks, we know how he works. I and feel this is surprisingly it. poorly for a man who's just jumped off a building. You're all right, Your blood man. sugar's probably low. Oh, okay, look at this. You better use one out. of those syringes. Have we got one? Wait, Ollie's got diabetes, so Ollie's blood sugar drops over time, making Ollie feel awful. When blood sugar is too high, Ollie's health will slowly deplete. Use a sucranese syringe to lower it, or wait. When blood sugar is too low, Ollie will have less health. Move more slowly, be weaker, and insult people on sight. Use a glucose syringe or eat food to go ahead and raise that good stuff. So, do we have one already? Let me just check. We do. So, quickly raises the blood sugar by 40%. Go ahead and do that. But if we can't craft those there. things, how don't you feel are we better? Do it? Maybe you could find a beehive nearby and steal some honey. I prefer okay. to think of it as harvesting. Thank you very much. All right, fair, fair, fair. First thing then on the agenda, guys, is to head over to the sweet spot, or is that the digging thing? Because I ain't a fan. Ah, in fact, wait. That must be in relation, I guess, toward the uh, beehive. So if we take it nice and chill, it said stay off the road because people just don't like Ollie as a whole. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's get over there. Looking like, though, guys, for Ollie, we're in for a bit. Have a treat with this story. One of the most hated people in Wellington Wells who still remains. I don't know how we're going to manage or what missions are going to prop up 
But it's gonna be difficult. You guys might be forgetting the most important thing. We are Ollie after all, so it's no freaking bother. Okay, we've got 18 of those skill points, guys. Let's go ahead and check out Ollie's skill tree. I think this is gonna be very important. Now, the first thing I'm gonna get, guys, is tracker. You can sprint faster and longer. I was instantly noticing how slow Ollie is compared to the other one, so yes, that is a must. We're also gonna get the healthier one right here. That seems like it's gonna be important down the line. Uh, so these are his natural quirks, though. We first of all know that Ollie is unwell. Also, he's very slow. Now, this one here is strong. You can choke out unaware people, including bobbies and doctors, and you can carry a lot more weight. So good stuff. That's a positive. Troublemaker. People just don't like Ollie for excellent reasons, which I'm sure we're gonna learn. And the last one here, the mechanics. So we're mechanically adept and chemically hopeless. The last thing we're gonna get is picky picky. So plants yield more resources. That seems like a good one for now. Okay, so we're all set. Now let's get back over to the honey. I'm actually taking a bit of a trip back on myself, guys. I actually remember the being one of the uh, beehives just outside of where Ollie's uh, residence was because, uh, you know, now it's gone. So uh, <laughs> come on, we're a big lad. Uh, I think we're literally watching a fight commence. And whilst they're going ahead and doing that, I don't see why I can't go ahead and snitch me some honey, you know? Uh, all right, then. Holy crap, there's so many of them. Look at that stuff. They're going in freaking... Okay, look, whilst they're all occupied, can I do this? Uh... <laughs> The freak. So I can't get to them. So what do I need to do? Oh god, they're following me. All right, the bees they're lurking. So if I bring them away, run back round. Hold up a sec. Give me that. Come on. Come on. Okay, keep it coming, fellas. Single line. All right. Okay, that's uh, yeah, that's not working. Get them nice and far away though. All right, now let's try and harvest this good stuff. Sometimes I wake up screaming. Oh god, if that dude starts on me, I'm done. Oh my god. Okay, come on, harvest, harvest, let's go. Uh, I got no time. Yeah, okay. All right, so the plan of action, getting honey at this moment in time, that don't seem feasible. I guess we're going to have to get, like, some kind of resistant suit, and I think we will. Everyone is just fighting everyone around here, actually, apart from me. And they said I would be the problem, you know? Look at this crap. Look at this crap. But there is two story quests at the minute. The first one is actually gathering the honey, and the second one is trying to retrieve the soldier over here. So perhaps in doing this one, maybe it will actually benefit us for getting a suit or something. Not 100% sure, though. Hey, what? I hear you. Nice and quiet, my dude. I'm coming. Okay, so find out who's yelling. Well, that would probably be the soldier. Go ahead, stay nice and sealed. They're still freaking fighting everyone. Right, this dude is taking the freaking bat to the face. Be quiet. There you go. Nice and sleepy. Dude, look at this chaos. Another one. Bro, back off. Get the freak out of my face. I'm going to go ahead and lockpick this. Anyway. <laughs> Casually just killing a couple of people. Don't mind me. I'm Ollie, by the way. Pleased to meet you. So now we're trespassing. We can see all the footsteps. Let's go ahead and search this. May as well get as much as we can. Okay, keeping it on the low. Another bottle for a distraction, perhaps. I feel like we need that right now. Another bigger banger. They got so many of these things pre-made up. I'm going to take them. Let's go up to the first floor right here. Be on the ready for absolutely anything. Though, I think they may be all contained just upstairs by the sounds of things. Right, I'm going to knock this guy out, by the way. Okay, still sneaky music. No one, no. He doesn't count, okay? We're good. Harry and St. George. Sounds good to me. So, we're going to lock this again. And there's the captive, and then we can speak to him, and I guess get things going. All right, my dude, let's talk to Private Burton, so, I think that is. how'd they get you? Yeah. Did they sneak into the camp? Oh, I, uh, got lost. Okay. I think he deserted. Maybe. Interesting, oh, if so. Taking French leave, or were you full out deserted? <laughs> it's always march, 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 drill, drill, drill. So we didn't want to do any more. Stabby, stabby, stabby with our bayonets. For years. The cherries are never going to come back, are they? I don't know. I need to go Being and real. talk to the general, but they won't let me cross the bridge. But they won't let you through the front gate either. Hmm. Well, I suppose I do owe you. Yeah, you're about to Listen, be French meat, my dude. Hey, what does that even mean? Sergeant what the Old Castle, you know what happened on Trim Street. What happened okay. on Trim Street? What happened on Trim Street? Yeah, can I'm we not know? Telling you By the way, that. I guess Dang. you're not heading back then. I guess not. See you okay. when I see you then. Not if I see you first. Uh, I don't know what that means, but cool. Okay then, so Quest found the camp of the fine enemies. I don't know what else we got to do here. I guess that was it with that guy. So get into the Victory Memorial Camp. That's it. All right, what's the situation? About normal. Okay, now I'm only just starting to understand right now, guys, how crazy this place is at this minute in time. Everyone is infested. Everyone is literally out to get you as well. It's kind of bizarre. It's almost like a zombie apocalypse type thing. So I'm going to go on the lookout for a safe house. It's one of my... <laughs> Okay. Like I was saying anyway, guys, it is like being in a zombie apocalypse, all right? Everyone is out to just about snap your balls up. Like, look at this crap. I'm walking casually. I I'm done. Okay, just avoid these guys here. Now, if I go ahead, make my way inside of here, lock the door. Apparently, there's a track access hatch somewhere, so I need to find it. Just hopped over here to wait it out. If you look as well, we've got a memory, so I'm going to go ahead and get that thing. 
This is going to be really, really interesting to see, I guess, the sort of memories Ollie's got of the place, because I guess he's like a different person. He's older, he knows more stuff. All right, we should be about good here, I think. Hop on over. First memory of Mum. All right, let's go ahead and see what he remembers. I made a doll of Mum. Is that Margaret? It's very like her. Is it? I wasn't sure. She was a tad taller. It's a doll. She was taller. That's not very funny. Well, I thought it was. <laughs> I'm sorry. You miss her. I guess. It's just how everything is now. Nothing's the same. The way things were hmm. doesn't even seem real. Oh, that sucks, dude. I sort of miss it. and I sort of... It doesn't seem real. That's yeah, fine. Too much wisdom at your age. It's hardly fair. I got to be a complete numpty until I was 30. <laughs> what are you smiling for? <laughs> okay, that was interesting. So I guess Ollie had a wife. Unfortunately, they must have parted. How the circumstances arose, we're yet to 100% know. But it sounds like the wife passed away somehow. Just finished up in the house itself, guys. I don't think... Oh, I wait. In Paris. Now we're fine? No one cares. Okay, oh, night times are a bad time. And that statement, though... Here we go, Lutz home station. This is our safe house. I'd imagine just through there as well. This is gonna be crucial, guys. The night times for Ollie are so freaking dangerous, man. Like, sleeping is gonna be so important, okay? They fear the light. Oh, do they now? Well, thanks for the insight. Let's go ahead and get some light on the go, you know? Oh, this feels very, like, ghostly, right? Very, very spooky. Okay, that looks like a blood trail, and the blood sugars talking of which are very low again. Oh my gosh. Wait, we've been here before. Hold on, let me go ahead and pull this thing. All right. So, this is where Arthur was, if I remember correct. And there's- is that a memory there? Moving house. I'm gonna take it before we do anything more. Unless the place is perhaps already cleared out, because, you know, maybe Arthur was here before. You could have killed someone! It's Sunday! Nobody goes to work on Sunday! It's what? Monday. Uh-oh. You're going to know it was you. You told everyone in the Duke's arms you were going to do it. What did we do? What were you thinking? What did you think, Les? I was thinking I won't have to see Uncle Jack's stupid- Face everywhere. We just what? put up another antenna. You're right. Oh. oh, you're always right. I think you better get out of town. And where do you expect me to live then? In the garden district. They and there we went. Visions there, do they? That explains that. We was once, I guess, up in the high ranks. That's probably how we annoyed everyone. So we got to get, I think, around the corner, flip the switch, and then we're pretty much good. Let's go ahead and do this now. Watch this quiet. Or is it already done? Wait, no one is actually here at all. I'm looking everywhere, so the place has been cleared out ahead of time. All right, good stuff. How the hell does all this work? <laughs> so we've got some stuff here, guys. The electric truncheon. Uh, let me just try and see what this I'll is going give on. It a whirl. We sure, touched that's it. Not how you do it. I we literally think you went like stick that. Stick to what you know. Yeah. So, uh, we're gonna leave that thing alone. Okay, so this here, I guess we're pretty good at. The no questions axe, and we've got the boxing shoes. So there's a few things we can make here, but now, I don't feel like nothing at the minute. That's a thing I know. Yeah, it sounds like it. So that is gonna be our solution then, I guess, to finding some of the good weapons, or at least making them. Crap, we can't use that either. All right, at least we know of its whereabouts, so that's one thing. Okay, guys, well, seeing as it's daytime at the minute, and I guess everyone seems relatively calm, I think I'm gonna go ahead and try and get one of these honey things done, because I desperately need some sauce for the glucose, okay? I've had to use my second shot already, and we're only on day two. This isn't looking good. <sighs> Still with this, huh? Still with this. Wait. What? What the freak is going on? Uh, Look, I'm ending that. I don't get what the freak is going on. I kind of wanted to know what the fox and the rabbit were doing. Hey, guys, can we just honor the architectural design of this house? You're going through there. Okay, you lay sideways. That's basically it. But the length of this house is about 150,000 meters, okay? Uh, nah, I'm good. Can we swap them out of the sky? You know? I don't think we can... How are we supposed to get rid of them? I don't understand. Oh, damn it. Now there's nothing I can do. Okay, we're gonna have to come back to the whole sugar pandemic that we currently got going. I think they did say, though, that you can get some from uh, maybe like a food source if you consume it. So we're gonna put that thing behind us for now, guys. Uh, what I'm gonna go ahead and do is visit the camp of Thine enemies, okay? Let's go ahead and see what's popping off there. And it may just be their heads, if you know what I'm saying. Now, I wonder how these guys are gonna react to Ollie coming up close. So talk to Sergeant Oldcastle at the bridge. Sergeant Oldcastle! I thought we could have have a chat about Trim Street. Shouting in the dude. Shut your bloody mouth, you fat bastard. Let him pass, lads. 
He's not wow. getting past the front gate anyway. Just this Goodness once. Me. Try it again, and I'll kill you. Bro, I'll break your neck, okay? Just saying. Okay. Sit the freak down. Let me talk to this guy That's here. That's it. On the double seater. Does he hit... I wouldn't say that where the Sarge could hear you. That was pretty savage, just saying. There's a memory there, we can't actually access it, so we probably gotta pick the lock. But are these guys gonna get weird about it? I mean, no, I don't GD care. Again. It's a good memory of mine, I guess. So, uh, let me just do that, and I'll be seeing you guys. Questions. Now, this one's gonna relate to the camp as well. Okay, so this is gonna be memory number three. So there's a bottle opening, alright. a bit sad today. Someone You're died. a bit nosy. You don't have to be mean. I am mean. Ask anybody. Hmm. But you don't have to be. You're right. Hey, it seems that? some of the lads over at the camp didn't like being prisoners of war, so they... Wow. Well, they decided to fight back. But they lost. What did the Germans do? The Germans? Nothing. They got all the other prisoners who didn't fight back. Made wow. them shoot them. Which would you have done if you'd been a prisoner of war? Fight back or? Aye. That's a question. Wow. Why aren't you a prisoner of war? And that's the other one. So many things propping up, and I'm ready to learn about it. Here we go. They're blowing up the distillery? In what? God's name, why? <laughs> so the, the soldiers don't get drunk all the time? Maybe. Maybe. I didn't have more important things to do. I'd put a stop to that right quick. Maybe we're gonna, you know? I ain't about to let them take the freaking alcohol source away. Get out of my way, Metal Gate. He's holding nothing back. Yo, what's this about the distillery being blown up? Yeah, one of these guys is going to talk to us again. King Starkey's back. I need to speak to the general. Get ain't going to work, right? What did I ever do to them? Wow. You know what you did. It I was a joke. <laughs> All right, it wasn't a joke. <laughs> what about the air raid shelter? It goes right under the fence. Ooh. You're right. You're always right. We can go through the general's Should've office, right? Should've gone through the air raid shelter. What the frick? That just went down so quick. I literally finished the convo, and now all of a sudden this? All right. Whatever. A dud bomb. Can I do Don't this? Do you like to extract the TNT from there? Oh. Interesting. I guess uh, I know what I'm doing somewhat. Don't explode. I think we're good. And I got TNT. Fantastic. All right, guys. Let's finish up, though, by checking this thing out, okay? So if we can gain access to here, that will be an awesome little thing, okay? And a nice setup for the next episode. So here Who we go. the hell blocked up the entrance to the air raid shelter? What if there was an air raid? Fair there point, hasn't been point. an aeroplane over Wellington Wells since 1950, has there? I'm going to have to blow a hole in it. Well, where are you going to get explosives? Oh, I got Easy. many, little girl, okay? <laughs> From the military camp. Haven't I got but we can't get into no. the military camp. Well, what about the distillery? They're going to blow it up. That's a good right. point, actually. You're always right. Huh. I wonder if they've blown it up yet. Maybe. By the way, that soldier just walking past, clearly seen us talking to ourselves. All right, see, the problem is this soldier in front right now, kind of blocking my... Right over, sir. That's all. Wait, now we're good? Okay, I'm just going to run past him. All right, let's just go over to the distillery, shall we? All right, here we go. Yeah. Okay, there's a dude there. We're going to have to take him out deaf. <laughs> He's drunk as freak. They all are drunk as freak. <laughs> It's gonna be so easy. Look, they're done already. Are you That's it. sure this is the only way? I don't know, but I'm doing it anyway. Okay, histoplasma. Were they drunk then, or were they slightly infected? I mean, check out the dude's hands. Let's be real. Okay. Anyway, oh, though, I feel like it's time. You don't know what you've got till it's gone. Yeah. Well, if you can't remember For things, sure. maybe you shouldn't be drinking. <laughs> That's true. You're right. That's a fair You're point. You're always right. A well, they obviously haven't have blown it right up there. yet. I yep. suppose now we just wait until someone comes by with a pack full of plastic. We take them out. They're trying to kill me. What the freak? Who? You, you know? have to help him. Maybe you'll give he us ever it. done for me? Well, he might be the man with the explosives. <laughs> That's true. You're right. You're always right. Okay. Let's see what his problem is. Let's go ahead and do it, Mister. Uh, whatever his second name is. How much liquor's left around here? Let's find that out Ollie, after. Focus. Help the man, and then let's go. All right. <laughs> Whoa! Look at this crap. My guy, I'm coming to the Thank rescue, okay? God, you're here. I think they draw to the plastic. Wait. Freak. Ollie's dark, eh? Yeah, you know well, me by name. I don't have to help you <laughs> if you'd rather work it out with the plague is. Probably going to be He's in now, right? Pal. We were in the Punjab together. Did you know okay. him? Haven't the fog, yes. <laughs> Are you going to help me out? I Are guess you we're going to help me out here, Starkey? I got you back. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> the freak was that Dragon Ball Z roar? <laughs> Well, I guess we're Damn waiting. Did I just kill him? Oh, or did, uh, you know, one of those guys kill him? I have no idea. Oh, and there we go. Either way, look, I don't know who you are, oh, Maiden Powell. Barnet Burn. 
Whatever that means. Whatever. Okay, he's got the explosives, the Lee Enfield rifle, and some well, meat. This will okay. blow a nice hole in the air raid shelter. That it will, my friend. That oh, it will. Oh, now I remember Beedham Powell. Will <laughs> kiss us. He was. Well, he's dead now. No, my side bone, I'm Ollie. Wow. Is that what you do while I'm scrounging all day, studying Latin? What's the bloody use of that? <sighs> Probably for that insult right there. You know what, guys? I'm actually going to leave this. <sighs> what the freak was that? I'm actually going to leave this episode here so we can start the next one off with a uh, with a bang. Okay. I'm sorry, I really am. But there we go, guys. That was the first episode of Ollie's chapter. I think this one is the shortest out of all of them, so it may be like a four to five part series, but uh, I'm not really 100% sure right now. Regardless, though, guys, I hope you did enjoy this episode, and the next one, of course, will be coming real soon. If you did enjoy this video, though, guys, why not drop me that like rating? And hey, if you're new around here, why not subscribe for more videos just like this one right here? So thank you so much for watching this video, guys. Of course, I hope you did enjoy, and I will, of course, see you on the next one.